We're about to go inside. This is Ray. She's my boyfriend's sister, but basically my sister too. <laughs> and we're about to head inside. I think it's like 6.30 or so, and the sun is rising. But yeah, so we're gonna head in soon. So excited. <laughs> it's currently 6.55, so the doors are gonna open in five minutes. Done. Guys, we had a really good haul. I can't wait to show you everything, but I am going to do a full haul at the very end of the video. So we are gonna go grab a breakfast and change, and then we're gonna head to our next location. Okay guys, so I showed you a little bit of what's in my bag and then we got some things too in her bag and they were only four dollars <laughs> for the whole bag. Like look how big, only four bucks. So the first place we went to was a rummage sale. So our total so far is four dollars. We're at our second location. This is another rummage sale, but this one is at a church in my nearby area. So let's go check it out. Oh my God, so, so stunning. Love. We aren't really seeing anything here. So I think we're just gonna head on to our next location. So that shop was basically a bust. Like none of us found anything. We didn't find anything and her mom didn't find anything. We're gonna head to a Salvation Army that's nearby and hopefully we'll have better luck there. I think that the cut of this top is super cute, but I feel like the white is kind of faded. So I think I'll pass on it, even though I love the cut. I also am not obsessed with the stripes. This one's also super cool, but I don't need it. So I'm also gonna leave it. Okay guys, so I didn't end up finding anything at Salvation Army, but Ray got something. I got this shirt. So cute. Very Y2K 70s. Yes, and it's mm. got like this halter tie. Very, very cute. cute, very excited to style it. Yes, and I feel like yellow and browns like look really good on you. Thank you. Now it's 1018 and there's a vintage market that we want to go to and it just opened at 10. So we're going to head there now. Guys, emergency pit stop. Look at this beautiful baby that we just saw on the side of the road. Hi, baby. Hi. Oh no, it's okay. Aww. Aww, Where'd he go? That dog did not want anything to do with us. He said bye. But hopefully he has an owner. Hopefully he gets back to where he came from. Because this is a dog park, but there's no owner in sight. So we're here. Look at this freaking adorable way to tag things. So smart. That's so cute. I found this cutie little baby doll girl. Oh my god, gorgeous.
look at these salt and pepper shakers. Those are so freaking cute. Oh my gosh. You are just so precious in your bag. You're just so cute. Um, you are just so cute. You're so beautiful. Hi. Oh my God. Guys, that market was so, so cute. Super cute. All the people that were there were so nice. Follow Drop Dead Vintage mm -hmm. on Instagram. Their owner is so nice. She's super sweet and has beautiful pieces, but sadly we didn't end up grabbing anything. No, not today. But she always gets in new stuff, so make sure you check her out. Now I think we're gonna head across the river to St. Louis, and then we'll see what goodies we can find in the thrift stores over there. That's me. All right guys, we just got these little scooters refreshers and I've never tried them before. I'm so excited. Oh, they're good. I told you. Mm -hmm. It is definitely like the Starbucks one, but more lemonade. So good. And it doesn't come with berries, which I always remove anyway. So, so yummy. We're gonna head to the Goodwill Bins now and they close in like two hours. So we're gonna go there now before they close. Okay guys, we are at the Goodwill bins. We always make sure that we wear these gloves. Ray picked them up last time. So they're just like rubber gloves so that way you don't get germs on our fingers. And she also packed some bags so that way we can like carry stuff out because we normally just carry everything in our arms. But since the clothing might be a little dirty, it's best to bring a bag and some people even wear masks, but it does make it hard to breathe because it's kind of hot. But yeah, okay, we'll see you guys in. Here we go. These are kind of cute. These are kind of cute, but I definitely don't need them. It's especially becoming summer. <laughs> Guys, look at these adorable glasses. So cute. Oh, perfect. A little dirty though. <laughs> oh my God, look what I just found. I know that these are super popular right now. Hmm. Just found this adorable. Ralph Lauren little shirt. Hmm. Pretty cute, but the bottom is a little tarnished, so. Uh. Oh my god, Sleeping Kirby is so cute, but look. He has been eaten by someone's dog. So sad. Cute. I saw a few Lulu bags, like just the ones you get from shopping, and I was like, I have a feeling that maybe we'll find some more items. And I saw some others, but they were not my size, but these might work. Guys, look at this beautiful dress. Are you kidding me? Someone like, do I get this? I probably shouldn't get it because where am I going to wear it? But look at, look at the 
eating. Oh my god, do I get it? I'm so conflicted. That is so, so pretty. We're getting in line now. We've only found a few things because we only got to shop for like an hour, if even that. So we're gonna grab lunch, hit up a few more shops, and we will be back when they restock at three. Alright guys, so we just got our stuff and we're gonna head to get some lunch like I said and then we will be back later and it'll be interesting to see how kind of crazy it is because we normally don't come right when they have refilled the bins. We normally come a little later so that'll be exciting to see. And also the prices of the stuff, like I got those three things for less than $2. If you haven't been to the bins, this is your time to go. Guys, we've got our hand sanitizer, even though we had gloves on. Just because you don't know where all of that stuff is, and there could be some very questionable things in the bins, you know? <laughs> Here we go! This Salvation Army is huge. And this is just one of the rooms and there's a room over there and over here. I love the little bow on this dress. Very cute. For whatever reason, we are just not having the best luck today. <laughs> we literally walked in, walked around, tried to go to the bathroom. It, the bathroom was not was the best. It was very scary, it was very scary. Yes, so we did not go to the bathroom there. We tried to walk around a little bit more, didn't really find anything. So now we're back in the car. I think we're gonna get some food, take a mini little break, and then I'll let you guys know what we do after. We're heading into this shop that is like a resale shop, but it's also like a straight rest. This little crusty self, like I, I love a crusty dog. <laughs> I picked up these two adorable little ascots to go on my puppy. I'm so excited to put these on him. They were made by volunteers, and this goes right through the collar, so it doesn't have to tie. <laughs> You're so sweet, <laughs> sweetie girl. Thank this you. This is Kenzie. Hi, Kenzie. <laughs> Hi. Have a nice day. And the total for these two was four dollars total. Guys, time for round two at the bins, and the people are already going in. I'm so excited! During our second round, I spent $4.60, which is still so great for all the pieces I got. Hopefully everything fits. We are gonna head to our last thrift shop of the evening. We're gonna head to a Savers. So I'll see you guys there. Guys, I know you can't read that, but it says $199.99. Huh? <laughs> Look at this adorable shirt. 
it has this little wrap around and then it's like oh this is so cute and it's got the really old vs tag so cute there's also this one it's a full length all the way to the bottom and then look at this detail on the slit that is so cute and here's the back like that is so cute Oh my gosh i feel like this could definitely be worn as a normal dress no like with little sticky boobs like hmm guys look what ray just found literally two of them and this is what the tag looks like isn't that so adorable oh ray look at the back that is so fun we might have to twin, that's kind of crazy. This is so freaking cute, oh my god. This is kind of cute, but I just wish it was a little tighter, like, so it was more form-fitting. So we're gonna pass on this. This one also is not fitting the best. I feel like it would also need to kind of be cinched a little more, and this would need to be a little lower. But it's still a beautiful dress. But I'm gonna leave this one as well. The total at Savers was $8.66. I am finally back from our long, long day of thrifting. It's about seven o'clock now and I am definitely tired. I'm definitely exhausted. So I think what I'm going to do is shower, relax, sleep, because I only got four hours of sleep last night, and then I will show you guys everything that I picked up tomorrow. So it'll only be a few seconds for you, but it'll be enough time for me to rest and recuperate myself so that way whenever I explain everything to you on what I got and how all of the places were, it will make a lot more sense. Okay, see you in a second. Hi guys, welcome back. Even though it's been like two seconds, but it's now the next day. So let's get into everything that I got from thrifting all day long yesterday. All right, guys, we are going to start off with the very first place we went yesterday, which was that 7 a.m. bag sale. So the way that sale works is you get a big brown paper bag like this or you can bring in a bag but then it's a different price point for one brown paper bag it is four dollars unless you get items that are priced individually you put everything in the bag that you see and then it's four dollars for whatever let's start off with this adorable makeup pouch which is um a christian dior beauty bag that comes whenever you purchase any makeup products from their beauty line but I have this bag in a different color. I actually got it in the navy version whenever I ordered some makeup products from there for my 21st birthday. I'm super excited to have the white one. It's super clean. There's still the plastic on the little zipper and the inside is perfect too. There were a ton of makeup pouches there during the sale and then Ray actually found the navy one so now we have matching ones which is so adorable next i don't know what was in the air but all of the disney cute vibes were just popping off yesterday we'll start off with this sweatshirt with the embroidered mickey mouse you see the texture so freaking cute love and it also has the mickey mouse disney tag which was amazing this will be perfect for work because I work at a peds clinic, so you can wear cute little kid-friendly attire. So Disney items are perfect. And I also just wear Disney stuff because I think it's cute. On the Disney theme, we've got this cute crew. It's just got the Walt Disney World print. So cute. Also the Disney Parks tag love and then the third disney item that i found 
was this embroidered Winnie the Pooh crew. So freaking cute. And it has this really old Pooh Bear tag on it. One of my baby brothers loves Winnie the Pooh. So I just thought this was precious. I also picked up this little pleated black skirt. I thought this would be perfect for outfits. And I like that it's not too sporty. I feel like this could be dressed up, dressed down, very versatile. I got some gray cargo sweats. I've been loving cargos. I have a pair of black ones from Brandy Melville and a pair of cream cargo sweatpants from Forever 21. And I wear them all the time. And I also wear gray all the time. So I thought that these would be perfect to add to my wardrobe. I also picked up these jean shorts, which don't fit. For some reason, I thought that they were going to fit if I used my little button hack where I used the button pin and moved it over, but it did not work, sadly. So I'm probably just going to have to donate these. I picked up two things for my boyfriend, just this white Nike shirt and the last piece I got is also for my boyfriend. It's this nice cream button shirt with the, the little polo collar. I thought it was very nice for summer. It's giving beach, it's giving vacation. And I think that cream will look really good with his complexion. The next shop that I got things from was the Goodwill Bins. I spent 163 at the Goodwill Bins. So that brings our overall total to 563. And whenever I was there during our first haul, I found these Chloe glasses, which are so nice. I'm going to go to my optometrist and get the correct prescription put in them because someone else's prescription is in right now. So I can't really see out of them, but I've been wanting a new pair of glasses and I thought that these were super, super cute. Kind of giving the librarian, like, what is that? business siren librarian siren something like that but they're like a cute little shape love i also picked up this little polo long sleeve and it has the little ralph lauren little flag very nice basic white long sleeve shirt the last thing i got from that first haul were these leggings they are a pair of lulu leggings um they are a size four and I just, I saw them inside out tangled up and I saw just this reflective part sticking out. I also work at a Plato's closet. So I am very accustomed to clothing brands and I'm able to identify things very quickly. So I was like, let me work with this. Let me untangle this. Cause I think that this could be a gem. And it was I paid $1 and 64 cents for all three of these items when I was literally at Lululemon last week and I almost bought a pair of leggings for a hundred dollars but you do need to be very patient and you have to be in the mood to thrift you want to search through all the aisles and make sure that you can find what you're looking for I really like thrifting because it's kind of like a treasure hunt you don't know what you're gonna find sometimes you'll have good days and you'll find amazing things and other days you'll have bad days when you don't get anything like how some of the shops we went to I didn't find a single thing that I wanted to get, but that's okay. You just have to wait and then the good things will come to you. Next, we went to that super, super sweet resale shop that was attached to the Humane Society dog rescue area. And if you looked out the window of the shop, it was literally connected to the area where the dogs would like go outside for training and run around. And it was just such a precious shop, such an amazing idea for them to take donations and then whatever money they make to put it back into feeding the dogs, caring for the dogs is just so amazing. I knew that I wanted to get something from there. So I got this adorable little ascot. And like I said before, you just slide the collar right in there and then it's so perfect and it won't fall off, it won't choke them. And I also got the same ascot in this so teddy is gonna be so dripped out for the summer he's got his ascots he has one on right now so i'm not gonna put these on yet 
but whenever he does have them on, he's going to be so cute. So our overall total from those three shops was $9.63. What is this, baby? What is this? Oh my gosh, so cute. The baby? <gasps> oh my goodness. <gasps> oh. <laughs> Yay, yeah, it looks so good. It looks so good on you, baby. Do you like it? You like it? You look so good. You look so cute. <laughs> oh, look at that waggy tail. So cute. So cute. Next, we went back to Goodwill after they refilled the bins for their second round of the day. And I got this super cute gray Calvin Klein bra. Just a nice, comfy loungewear piece. And I have this bra already in white. So I knew that it would be comfortable and fit and that I would like it. I also found this super cute Brazil baby tee. If you have a Pinterest, if you're into fashion, you know the Brazil baby tees are just popping off right now. Like, and same with like jerseys and really long jewelry with like the crosses. And like, it's like, I don't know. It's such a cute style that I've been seeing and loving on Pinterest. And when I saw this tee, I was like, are you joking? Like the thrift gods are just in, they're just like raining down on me today. They're like, here you go, girl, enjoy. And it is so, so cute. I can't wait to style it during the summer. I just think it'll look so cute. I also picked up these jeans. They look like, look at that nice wide leg, beautiful wash, not too dark, not too light. They don't fit. I tried them on, they don't fit. For whatever reason, the crotch is like 10 miles long. So they don't fit, they're not flattering. I will also have to sadly donate these as well. That's the risk you take with things from the bins. I usually don't try things on at the bins just because, yeah. The last thing I got at the Goodwill bins for a second round was this purse. I don't think it's authentic just because of the obvious wear and tear. Although I suppose it could just be old. I'm not really certain, but I loved the pink because I've just been wanting a pink purse. So I saw it, I was like, that's cute. Like, authentic or not, I like the color. So the authenticity isn't going to change how much I like the color and the design of the bag. I thought this would be super cute for spring and summer, especially since I'm obsessed with pink right now and probably will be for a really long time. The total from that run was $4.60. So our new total is $14.23 from those stores so far. The last place I went on my thrifting marathon yesterday was Savers, and this is one of my favorite thrift stores, as you guys know if you've watched my previous thrifting videos. So when we first walk in, Ray and I, we, well, I'm not going to speak for her, but I'm going to speak for myself. I was starting to get tired. We only had four hours of sleep, if that, and we've been walking around all day, on our feet, no sleep. So... We're like, okay, yeah, we'll go through here. We'll just see if there's anything cute that catches our eye. We're not really into it anymore. We see these, I don't know the character, but some type of character Gucci collab t-shirt is hanging up behind the counter. And the worker brought them down for us to see and they were listed for $200 each. And I showed you guys that t-shirt and I was like, what the heck? And previously, like I would say a few weeks before, I saw another Gucci t-shirt out on the floor, but it was not cute. It was a brown and black bumblebee embroidered on, and it said something in another language that I didn't know what it said. And then the bumblebee's embroidery was like all messed up, like the strings were coming off. I don't like it just because it says Gucci, I'm not going to buy it. And then I was there yesterday and I told Ray about that story and we're in different sections of the store and she calls me and she's like, oh, hey, like I, I found those Disney gucci shirts that you were talking about and i was like disney gucci shirts like what are you talking about like what are, what are you talking about so then i went and met up with her and she found those two shirts that i think were just so freaking cute here it is 
please take a moment. Can you, can you tell that it's puffy? I don't know if you can tell. I will make sure that you guys get a really good, you can kind of see the puffiness, like the puffy paint. It is such nice quality. It has the Disney Gucci little tag. And when I looked this collab up online, it is a legit collab. I don't know, obviously, if this shirt is definitely from the line or not, but nonetheless, it is a nice shirt. It's so freaking cute. Like for the summer, look at Donald Duck just playing basketball. Obsessed, so obsessed. This shirt was $9.99, but I had a discount because whenever you donate clothing there, you get little coupons. And I, my mom and I, we donated stuff a few weeks ago, so I still had a coupon. So I got 20% off. So my final total was $8.66. So my overall total for that major thrift shopping spree was $22.89. I'm so happy with the pieces that I found. I can't wait to style them for the summertime. And I'm just so grateful I got to spend time with Ray. I love spending time with her. She's the sweetest. I hope that you guys enjoyed this haul and enjoyed coming along with me yesterday for thrifting literally all day long. Let me know what your guys' favorite item was or if there was something I showed you that I didn't get that you would have picked up yourself. I hope you guys have a wonderful day. I'm so thankful that you're alive and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!